Hello and welcome to Fiona's Creative Canvas. I'm Fiona and today I'm going to be laying some pillow paint uh, and doing a swipe with these beautiful colours here. These are all metallics. Um, I'm going to be using a black swipe mix and I'm just going to kind of go with the flow today. Experimenting. So let's get started. Okay, so I've got my British Paints uh, Walls Interior Pillow Paint. I'm going to pop that down first. Something like that. Maybe a little bit. I can actually put a bit on later if I want though. So I just want to kind of get this towards the corners there. Bit square it off a bit and I thought about going through with a white swipe mix first and just putting some of these sort of blue green maybe base um, through it and then doing the black swipe with the other colors on the top so ooh, you know what I'm gonna do it this way Try doing a little bit of this. Maybe a little bit of this darker one as well but I'm not putting the gold or the uh, I think it's antique bronze through so I don't want a lot of this it's just supposed to be kind of light so I might leave it at that that could be interesting experimental Missed a bit there. Quite like that. You can see cells opening up a little bit. The lacing. Now I'm going to wipe with the black all right first one I'm gonna just load the palette knife all the colors on
not sure what's going on here. I like this bit the best. It's feeling like I need to come this way though. I'm going to try a different palette knife. Just want to maybe do a little bit of dabbling. Can I get a bit of gold going through there? It's actually gone quite colourful. Give this a little spin. Probably should get these out of the way so they don't get paint in them. So I really want to keep this bit. Oh, this is looking beautiful through here. Um, might just add a little bit of white up there. I don't want this to come too much further off here. And a tiny bit on there as well. I think I'm nearly there. Okay, we're going to have to do a little bit just here. Yeah. Then I can scoop that. That's clean. Okay. Just making sure that's covered. 
and then just decide if I want to spin it anymore. I mean, I do like it the way it is. I'll just spin that a little bit more. Okay, I think that's it. It's a very soft, soft, but then some pops of color and yeah, I really like this background. It's very pretty. Okay, I'll bring you in for our wet look. Okay, here is the wet result and I love the background it's soft and the lacing is just really soft and subtle and then you've got this blast of color through the middle with the black lacing it's just nice and crisp so the lacing is so different. It's really soft here and then it's really crisp. So I love the contrast of the back. And then of course I've got negative space as well. And I like the composition. Uh, if I was to do it again, I probably wouldn't use the antique bronze though, but it does add something to this piece. It's, it's a bit of pop, I guess. Hmm. I will bring you back when it's dry. Okay, here is the dry result. And I really like the, uh, the way this one turned out. Bring you in closer. The, um, the added uh, copper actually has grown on me, the pop of color. Look at the cells through the lacing up here. It's like I like the background more than I like the rest of it. It's quite funny. They're just, oh, it's just so soft. But um, the lacing through here is quite good. Oh my goodness, I haven't noticed that before. Can you see that? There is lacing underneath. You can see through that gold through to lacing that's underneath and through here. I've just noticed that. That is crazy. Wow. So these must be transparent then. Maybe that's why they look the way they do. Yeah. I hope, I hope this is nice and clear so you can see. Yeah. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed that one I I'm thinking about having another go I've got a couple of other videos um, to come up but um, I've got a burgundy one with a swipe coming up and then I'm gonna have a go at resin art so that'll be interesting as well and then after that I might uh, explore this method again so uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed that and I shall see you all in the next one. Bye.